What's happening everybody? Um, coming back here. I got a mail day video here to make from Den1013. Really nice guy, Denny. Thank you so much, buddy, for sending this. Greatly appreciate it. Um, but before I get to that, I wanted to show this because uh, Victor asked me to show him my Sandy Alomar um, autograph batter's helmet that I got signed. And I also have a photo of me holding this right after he signed it that my wife took but i for the life of me i can't find that darn photo victor and i'm so sorry about that but uh i i know i put it in a video a, a while back but uh i i think i set it as one of them deals i set it aside in case i ever wanted to put it in another video and uh and now i can't find it so i should have just put it back where it was <laughs> but uh Plus, uh, you know, I haven't been break. I wanted to explain I haven't been breaking a lot of stuff, and that's because I plan. I'm saving. You know, I live here very near to Cleveland. I'm saving every dollar I can now to uh, because I really want to take advantage of as many deals as I can at the Nationals. But I'll probably get back to breaking some stuff. You know, after after Nationals ends. But uh, let's see what uh, my good friend Denny here um, sent my way. Cut this open. Uh, um, oh yeah, and Victor, I also got a ball signed that day too. I had the hat and then I had a ball for my wife to get signed for me. I actually, and I went to a couple other signings of his, but I've given given some away over the years. I should have kept some of those. But I uh, also went to Omar Vizquel signing. I know I've shown these a few times before. Um, Bartolo Colon, I got to meet him at the mall. Got to meet Omar at a car show. And um, my wife bought me the Manny Ramirez, um, his rookie year. So, and very cool, man. I'm glad she got me that. But let, let me let me show you what uh, Denny sent my way. So, thank you so much for this, Denny. Just a super awesome dude. I will put his link in the des in the description box. Here are all of the Lindor and Indians cards I had aside for you. Enjoy, my friend, Denny Wagner. So very cool, Denny. Can't wait to see what you sent my way. Especially since I haven't been picking up any cards because I'm trying to save for the Nationals. It's nice to finally get something to check out and put in my collection. Very cool right there. So we got the uh, Heritage Kluber. I think these are numbered to 199 or something, aren't they? No. No, they're not. I'm wrong on that. Huh. Surprised. Such a cool looking card. Very nice, dude. Thank you. Love building that uh, Kluber PC. And we got this Francisco Lindor out of Dunross with the blue foil border. These are nice. Oh, sweet. And a Barry Sanders, uh, 1991 Upper Deck uh, Hollow. That is cool. I got a couple of these, and I'm more than happy to take another one. That's sweet, man. And this thing's pretty well centered, too. Very good shape. That's awesome. Oh, and I really like this. has got to be an action pack, huh? Yeah, Dan Marino. Man, that's cool. It's that PC Dan the Man as well. And I don't think I have that either. All gold like that? Never seen that. Huh, sweet. I think that's kind of like a maybe a short printer. Oh, it's a G12, so it's a I'm, I'm assuming gold. Huh, that's cool. Full 14 karat gold, it says right on it. Wow, that's damn, Denny, that's cool. Let's put that right there. That's awesome. And then we have a uh, Lindor heritage with the purple foil, like hologram deal. These are sweet. Thank you so much, dude. That's nice. Oh, this is cool. Yeah, man, that is that is awesome. I've seen some people pulling these, too. Um, very cool, Denny. Love that. I can't remember if this is the one you said in one of your videos that you were going to send to me or not. But I uh, definitely don't have this. And, man, that's that's awesome. I'm stoked to put that in my collection. I know it's a manufactured deal, but I don't even care. That's, that's just a cool card. Very thick card. Huh, sweet. Man, that's, that's cool. And then we have this... Uh, Oh, there's actually a couple cards in here. Let me get this stuff out of here. All right, Tyler Naquin. Is that a Future Stars? Yep. Very nice tops chrome. Man, I wish they were still making football cards. And we got this Carlos Baerga. Very cool. What is this? Not familiar with this. I'm not, not a big baseball guy other than my Indians. Baking company, huh? Interesting. Francisco Lindor and some newer tops. Oh man, that's cool. Future stars, but it's not a 
top screw. I didn't know you you could get like a like a paper one of these future stars. That's cool. Huh. Thanks, man. I definitely don't have that. And that's a sharp card too. Damn. Francisco Lindor, I don't have this either at a tops. Huh, sweet. Francisco Lindor, All Star, 35th anniversary. This is new to me too. Huh. Got that old school look too. That's cool, man. Thanks. Hooking me up with some Lindors I just I just simply didn't have. Hmm, interesting. Another one of those. And then we have this Francisco Lindor that I don't have either. This must be like some Series 2 or something. I don't know. I didn't didn't bust a whole lot of new tops, though, so I don't know. But that's really cool. I'm glad you... Man, I'm glad you sent, sent them my way because I just... I don't have them. So very cool, man, Denny. You're an awesome guy. Greatly appreciate that, man. It'd be really kick-ass one day to be able to meet you, buddy. Um... And once again, Victor, you know, I finally remembered to uh, show the Sandy Alomar, and, and I thought I'd throw in some of the other Indians' autographs that I got over the years, too, to show. But uh, thank you so much, Danny, for giving me a reason to make a video, because I didn't have one, and I got a chance to say hi and explain my situation. And I was just saving money for the Nationals in a couple weeks. But uh, thank you all so much, and uh, we'll see you on the other side of the glass.